Hey there, creative friends. Hey, it's Rebecca here. Hey, and I just wanted to show you, uh, again, I'm still having fun with this 3D printer, but one of the things that really sold me on 3D printing was watching people embed different items into the plastic itself. And so this is so cool. And here's my first experiment I wanted to show you, and uh, more to come on this later. But um, take a look at this. Uh, this is just a real simple necklace, a, a two-layer necklace where it's got a, a white solid layer. And then um, I have, uh, using an SVG file from a different program, uh, Cricut Access actually, I uh, did this top pink layer and so anyway it worked as a great necklace and I had made one and just glued the um, necklace bail the the component there at the top that holds it to the chain I had just glued it on the back but now check this out um, this one that I made <clears throat> I had a, uh, a space in there uh, reserved for this uh, jewelry component and I had to fold it out flat to get this to work so uh, you have to be real careful this metal would be real fragile the more you work with it but I unfolded this flat and left a space in the plastic with a pause as it's printing so that I could embed this into the necklace itself and it worked I am so excited and so I was a little bit worried here that it was not clear but um, check this out it really is going to work so this particular model it uh, had a few layers of the plastic and then again I subtracted out enough space for the bale itself and then um, let the print pause so that I could put the uh, piece of metal into the plastic and then here it is continuing and I was uh, a little worried as it, as it was working because I wanted to make sure it was going to clear and not hang on it I didn't even glue it or anything I just placed it right in the spot and it is working I'm so excited and so just to show you I'm probably going to be experimenting with all kinds of other things um, but look at that it came back and then this is the layer that's covering up the, uh, the metal component and I was just so excited it did work and I feel like I did have to put it out flat just so it wouldn't catch on the print head as it's moving um, but you could also experiment with that um, and then uh, once it finishes printing you just have to bend that back to where it will uh, hang on the chain um, but very very cool being able to embed things into our 3d prints and so thanks uh, thanks for watching I'm just going to uh, let this finish out with some uh, faster uh, finishing of this particular item thanks